Welcome back for another Door King Tech Tip. Let's get started. Open up your Door King 32 account manager software. Now with the Door King software open, let's pick an account on the left by opening the folder with the plus sign. With the folder now open, click on Resident. You should now see all of your resident names, phone numbers, and codes. The Door King program works like Excel. To start, click the Add button in the top left toolbar. This will give you a line at the bottom of your database to start typing in your resident information. The resident column is for the resident's name and can be up to 15 characters long. The hide column is to hide the resident's name from the display on the system. The AAC column stands for alternate area code. This is where the area code for the resident will go. Phone is where the seven digit number goes that the system will dial to call the resident. DIR is the directory code. This is kind of like the resident folder where all the information is stored. This number will self populate. It can also be changed but must be unique. The ENT column is for the entry code. This is a code that can be used on the keypad to unlock the door. The SL column and beyond are for access control systems. SL stands for security level. This is what controls their access. The column will self populate with a 01 which is full access. The T column is for the type of device. It will populate with a C when a device number is entered from factory. The device number column is where you would input card numbers, remote numbers, and weekend device codes. They are five digit numbers ranging from 0000 to 65405. The next two columns, FL and ER, deal with elevator control boards. FL stands for floor. This is the floor that the resident lives on. ER stands for elevator reference, and this will self populate with a 1. The notes column is typically used to put license plate numbers, apartment numbers, secondary contact, or whatever you would like. Notes, however, do not transfer to the system and are only visible on your computer. Once you have filled out all the information on your tenant, click account in the top left and your data will be saved on the computer. All that's left now is to send data to your system and check to make sure everything is working like you programmed it. We'll see you next time for more Door King Tech Tips.